turn on your phone like that this is me, please. Because it's about to get real serious. Turn on your phone, light on your phone for me, please. I ain't calling out the next artist. So you turn on your light like this. All the ugly people remain where you are, good looking people. You take two steps forward. Taking over Kingston. A touch of class. I want you to get ready and welcome Tio. Tio. of Kingston, the original Kings, the only Kings, T O K. Too long, it's too been too long. long. Yeah, too definitely long. over 10 years. 10 years, over yes, 10. yes. Okay, so tell me, how has it been for you guys? What have you guys been doing, first of all? Um, well, basically, we've been working on solar projects as well, you know what I mean? They, they, I mean, I guess through the whole breakup, you know, basically had his album that he dropped last year. I dropped my album in January. Craig T has his album, he's working on And Flex also has his album. So, apart from the individual projects, right now, it's all about TOK, you know, the researchers of the brand. You know, our brand new single out called NPLH, which means no place like home. So, it's just full circle, full vibe, and full energy. Oh, and it's, and it's awesome that. to connect with the Barbados crew. Yeah. yeah. So, we have an evolution of dance hall. Now you guys are the foundation for me. Okay. What dance hall was? It was it was about community, it was passion, about love. Yeah. And then we've got all of this. Dance hall trap. Say. Yes. Yeah. How do you guys feel about that? All right. So it's it's a bittersweet thing. Um, dance hall trap is a different sound than dance hall. It's more hip hop sound. But at the same time, the next generation will always reinterpret the sound and create a new sound for themselves. So I have no problem with dance or trap. I think the most important thing is for us to have representation from the original dance hall and the new generation so that we still have um, something there for everybody. Um, I think when the dance hall trap is branded as dance hall, then the fans who love dance hall will be like, yo, what is this? Right. And I think it's, I think that's part of the reason why we, we reunited because we understood that there is this gap in the whole 
ecosystem of dance hall and this evolution and there's no other TOK, there's no other group in the space. So it's incumbent on us to to put that sound in the space, to represent for dance hall. We can adapt, we can go to dance hall trap, we can go to Afrobeats, we can go to reg reggaeton because we're musicians and we're harmony fo focused. So we can adapt to any song, but the most important thing is for us to um, to make the distinction between the different sounds and to understand that the new sound is very cool and it's very relevant to the new generation but we have to be here for the, the other generation and um, I think like this festival has been a good reflection of that where you have artists like Skeng that's doing the new generation you have the vintage like third world and then you have TOK that's right in the middle of everything um, we can go on the stage and do dance hall and then we can flip and do songs like footprints and give them dance uh, one drop and um, I think there's something there for everybody but the important thing is to understand each person's place in the in the whole ecosystem and um, for us I think we can dominate all of the spaces <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah yeah okay so my final question is your favorite thing about Barbados that, that thing that the energy that we get from the women in, in, in Barbados has always been amazing um, and I, I love the love that they show us it's, it's really cool it's really cool we've always been embraced and appreciated I love that yeah, yeah. yourself yeah man first off big up to all the rude boys I'm out there yeah so much respect enough salute from TOK but I have to concur with my bridge you know, I love the Barbados I love the beige on them man They've, it's like what we in Jamaica would say yo thick like cornmeal porridge <laughs> Tick. You understand? When they say lobster tail, all they meet in the back, boy, they wasn't playing now. <laughs> Trust me, I enjoy the scenery. You understand? And I mean, fun and joke aside, even though I'm serious, the, the reality of it is that just the energy we get here and the vibe of the people, them, everybody has, once again, we've been away for so long, but the, all the love and, the, and, and, and from the DJs, the selectors, the people on the road, you know, I mean, it's like a second home. It really is. So, I mean, I miss it, I love it, and it's like, it, it feels so good just to be back, you understand? So much love to you people, much love to the Bajans, pick up the Barbies, pick up everybody, you see me? Mad! <laughs> I love that! Um, I, I think two things. I think one is um, it's definitely I uh, appreciate the the love from the fans because Barbados fans know us from before the crossover, from early TOK history. But I think also on a personal level, I'm very very humble and um, I admire the new Barbados, the Barbados that has walked away from. From the Queen, the Barbados has walked away from the Commonwealth. I have so much love for your Prime Minister, and I think in former years, till um, Jamaica was representing that kind of rebellious spirit, and I think Barbados has, has rose to the occasion with this um, rebellious spirit with Maya, with the, with the Prime Minister, and I think where other prime ministers and other leaders have been sugarcoating it i think she speaks the truth to un to everybody i think she's a jamaican at heart you know and i feel so pleased and 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 i'm so humble and literally sometimes i'm at tears to see how barbados that once was seen as a timid crown of the jewel has risen up and said f that you know what i mean so i love barbados i love Rihanna, I love the fact that she's a hero. I love so much about Barbados and to know that TOK from 20 years ago was seeing this timid country, culture-wise, rise to be like, yo, we are not taking the effort no more and we're going to be a global um, island that speak out against injustice. I have so much love for Barbados and that, and that regard. And at the same time, to come on the concert and mash up the place and people show so much love, it's really amazing so Barbados is really like a, a, a second home to me a third home I don't want big up I don't I, I don't turn away Trinidad but Trinidad Barbados Jamaica is like homes to me and um, I just love the trajectory that you guys
guys have and I wish you all the best in your go green in your um, 20 years from now I see you as a global force to be reckoned with like Singapore and Jamaica went independent in 1962 and at the point when we went the independent we were our dollar was more valuable was more was more valuable than the US dollar and throughout the first 10 years our dollar went down so I just wish Barbados all the all the blessings all the value when the superpowers try to come against you keep your dollar value keep your culture keep you going green don't let them get you down and um, you're you're a shining example to the rest of the Caribbean of what it is to stand in the face of adversity and be independent truly independent so from that from my heart I love Barbados for that basic for president <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so two things. What does TOK stand for? And then end off with your favorite phrase from your one of your songs. Okay, so originally when we broke up, up until the point we broke up, TOK meant tribe of um meant touch of class. Touch. touch of class. Touch of class. Ah, but now that we have reunited, we have reunited as a brand meaning tribe of kings. Ah, tribe of kings. So four kings, one mission. And um, in terms of quotes from our songs, um, I, for me, it's solid as a rock. Many rise, many drop, but we're solid as a rock. Yeah. Right, so you guys can let me hear a few lines. Just a few lines from one, yeah? Many rise, many drop, but we solid as a rock. Them they think we would have laughed, but we solid as a rock.